Right, hopefully no more uh, wine spilling. I mean, let's not rule anything out. No, that's why we're hopefully not anymore. No guarantees. Well, you know, first time, first time. Not a, never a time, but first time. Right, so what's our plan for this? We see an out the season or we take I think in. We should. Yeah. Um, yeah. Think of it as more as a celebration of uh, we can dick about a bit. Plus, I want to. I well, we should think about the uh, the intercontinental or whatever that we get to start next season. I think that might should that maybe should be our end point. I don't know. What intercontinental thing? Uh, we play the winner of the Champions League, right? Because we won the site. No, okay, no, maybe we don't. Cause we won the Asian thing. I don't know. I, I assume oh. we have some kind of continental super cup thing. That oh, the super cup. Yeah. I mean, if we got one, then yeah, that should be our end point to be like. Look how damn good we are, or okay, we lost. Whatever. Well, we'll get the Asian Super Cups. We did that last time, right? But I mean, we also yeah. have like the here's the champions of yeah. South America or whatever. It yeah. Us against, I don't know. Yeah, and then we probably play the European ones. Or maybe there yeah, is a I know world what about. championship yeah. or whatever. I don't know. Yeah, World Club Cup or whatever the heck they call it. Where are you going, Bale? I mean, I don't know where he was off. It was like, it's, it's just pretty straightforward, Bale. You just go the direction you're going instead of turning. Yeah, you're doing good in your F1. Uh, yeah, I was quite surprised to see I bumped the difficulty up higher than I've ever put it before. Yeah? Oh, I'm not saying we won comfortably, but, uh, you know, you're not done bad. It is a lot more comfortable than I was expecting. Yeah, I mean, you're, what, plus 30 seconds odd? Yeah. Yeah. Has Jensen button pulled his finger out his ass yet? Yes, he did. He finished fifth, which oh, is like okay. the first point, first time I've had a second driver actually earn points in one of these fucking games. Yeah, because I did notice uh, the other day when he played it, it was like, oh, Jensen's done nothing, has he? Well, the other day it was Massa, but yeah. yes. Oh, He's Massa. Oh, okay. sod. All oh, right. Yeah, because I think you ha quite comfortably won the season, but then... What is it? Everybody else was like, no, I don't want to drive. I was like, yeah, okay. I, I, I won the driver's championship, but couldn't win the, the constructor's championship. Yeah. But that looks like it might change this season. Oh, you'd hope. I was about to say, did uh, you win all your races last season? Uh, all but one, because I skipped Monaco. Oh, okay. Let's fuck Monaco. That bad. I mean... Yes, <laughs> is the short answer. Yes. Oh, fair enough. Uh, that would like so. If you imagine, maybe throughout the course of a normal race, I used the flashback thing, at say five to six times, being yeah. very generous, right? On Monaco, it'd be about forty-five. Give me a minute. Mm -hmm.
don't know how long it's going to be. So, uh, alternate stream time. Shop Titans, baby. Who likes free to play mobile ports? I sure do. Not even kidding. See, you never know what you're going to get with a, a Sith Pro Evo stream. Sometimes it's Pro Evo, sometimes it's very much not Pro Evo. Oh, hang on. I'd hate to disappoint anybody that really tuned in for this thingy my bob pro shop stuff. Uh, yeah. Any, like, yeah, you sort them out, yeah. All these, there we go, I'm good. Yeah. Yeah, basically, it did not like the amount of uh, toilet tissue that I used to clean the wine up. Okay. Yeah. When I flushed it, it went no. So, yeah, right, I'm back and, yeah, let's play some Pro Evo. This Val Buena lad can fucking pass. He can, yeah. to worry about winning the game but it's nice if we do it's getting the habit yeah i mean i still think we should be getting one up and then fucking around but oh yes. i oh i meant that as well yeah it's always just a little bit too far in front of them yeah, I sort of thought, boy, he's either going to smash it like he did, or he's going to have a lovely dip in shots. Oh. Yeah. Well, at least he used his left peg this time. He uses it. I gotta make this big, weird, right footed movement. No, Seth. No. We have a goalkeeper. He also can play the ball with his feet. Madness. No, it's true. I, I've done it in yeah. real life and everything. Oh, okay. Like a what, bit. What did the goalkeeper's union think of that? Huh? What did the goalkeeper's union think of that? Oh, they were very happy about it. Yeah? Okay. Crazy bastards. Oh, well, I was supposed to go to the guy in the field, but sure. That's not at all where that was meant to go. I'm gonna go all the way out to Rebury. Yep. Let's try again at somebody who can pass. Ah, uh, he can. Look at that, got us a nice free kick. I mean, you probably got you a free kick, let's be real. That's how this works. We're a team. Sure, but I don't get to take free kicks ever. You know this. I do. Oh, what a fucking surprise! Oh, we got taken out. Bail. Yeah. 
I'll take. It really does feel like I've taken one free kick for every ten you've had. That's, pro that's probably about right, to be fair. Ooh. I feel like we need to uh, increase the fucking bait quotient in this game. Yeah. Given the Val Boyne is a good start. I figured. <laughs> One day. Great, but almost. Yeah. So after watching the F1 stream, Sip, what do you reckon? You got to bust the wheel out and uh, you could do a cop career. Ah, <laughs> you're funny. That's why people watch you. Uh, barely got motivation. Don't get me wrong. It, it would take you some practice, but I think yeah. you could do it. Yeah. Well. Barely got motivation to do a lot of things at the moment. Uh, uh, so oh, you know. I know. Yeah. But yeah, that's an idea, I, you know. I just really want, there's like a literal uh, uh, two-player career in yeah. uh, the new one, and I want to do it. Well, we ain't winning the Constructors' anyway. Championship. How oh, we might. Yeah. Because like, we wouldn't put it on fucking AI level for me, because that'd be fucking brutal for you. So. Yeah, I'd be like, oh, lapped. How many laps have you done? Three. You also don't necessarily need to be on the same team, if there is that option. Oh, okay. Oh shit. Yeah. White right, mate, calm down. Yeah. Well, you know, you score against the champions. Yeah. Count out. Hey. <laughs> Crossbar on in. Fuck your goal. Yeah. <laughs> That's how you respond. Well, Wayne is too good out there, man. He really is. If I get to Val well, Bane, I'll just make the run because I know what's coming. Boom. Yeah, that's the other way we could do a a, a theoretical call back one. Yeah. Put, put you in a in a Mercedes and put me in a Williams and then So you'd have that advantage. I don't yes. know. You gotta consider as well, I spin all the time in that fucking game, but because I'm doing single player I can rewind it. I did see a bit of flashback. So like you would win races just by keeping the car on the track. 
The slow and steady wins the race. Exactly. It's a thought. It is a thought. Although, to be honest, I might even say don't get a new F1, get one of the old ones I've already got that used to have the co op career in it as well. Yeah, I think it's I got, like fucking 50 bucks cheaper. I think I got 2019. I want to say it might not be in that one. Uh, probably be the one I do have that I think in. Well, like all sports games, the old versions go super cheap, so. Yeah. We could potentially figure something out, but that's for another that's for another day. Yes, very much another day. All. Yeah. <sighs> oh, we talked about playing some Gran Turismo, and that never happened. No. That was one of those moments where life very much got in the way, I think. Yeah. Another thing is after time, it's... So I work on and off, by the time I do go to work, I end up absolutely knackered because I'm not used to it. I said yeah. it sounds, yeah, it just goes, oh, you've been on your feet for six hours? Yeah, it's not much, but it's enough. Because it's not like, you know, oh, okay, you're working morning, morning, morning. It's like, no, I'm working mid-morning to afternoon, and then next day is the afternoon to evening. It's like, uh, it's like, uh, you know. Got an iron or two in the fire, so we'll see how they pan out. Good stuff. Yeah, one of them might even see me working a Monday to Friday. Ah, shit. Ah, you know. The hours still aren't bad either. It's like, you know, earliest is about a quarter past six. Latest about seven at the moment, possibly moving to an eight. But Monday to Friday, bank holidays off. What is this madness? almost like a normal job for a normal human being or something. Yeah, which is what I want, except there will be seems to be a lot of places to go, we offer flexible working. Well, that's great for those that want it, but I want what used to be the old 9 to 5, so, so to speak. But apparently I'm weird for wanting that. You know, heaven forbid I have a set routine and then the weekend off. Ah, uh, that's not what it's cracked up to be. Uh, I think for me it will be. It may very well. Yeah. I can get something approaching a sleeping pattern. Yeah, that's where that bit falls apart for me. Yeah. I went to sleep at 5am this morning. And I was <laughs> awake again at 9. Exactly. Yeah. Hi. Nicely done. Oh, talk of the games we never got right to play and that we should fucking play. Yeah. Uh, we should play Splatoon on stream. Yeah, we've not done that yet. Seems that we both have the means to do it, we could do some cool double stream business. Yeah. Exactly. Do some squad streaming nonsense. Yeah. People could sing up both fucking streams. I don't know why you'd want to, but you could. We could, yes. Plus, I just want any reason to play Splatoon, but I like that game a lot. Yeah, sounds good. I mean, I can even use my headset with it, but then I don't need to use my headset with ah. it, because I can use it through Discord, don't I? Yes. Ah. Yes. 
But if I ever need to, there's the option to USB-C it with a switch, which is nice. It's very useful. Oh. I will do the same thing. I'll hook my uh, my in-ear fucking my noise cancelling things to the computer, and then put these cans over that. Yeah, I mean... so I can hear. So I hear Splatoon through these, and then I hear the computer through the fucking in-ear stuff, and it all syncs up quite nicely. Oh, okay. We get the whole noise cancelling pass through whatever, whatever, whatever. Yeah. That's not our player. Sure isn't. Port Shrivers might be all over that. Ah, uh, that might just be only in our minds. Shh. Uh, but when the uh, Asian League best player, or Asian best player, whatever yeah. it is, Asian area best player. That's what I think. Bell, anyway. probably. We might go by like, goals or well, based on that, might be Bretsky actually. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. I don't know. I, I think Shrivers is in with a good shout. I think we checked before. I think he was top goal scorer. No. I think at one point he was. So. Uh... Oh, he's offside. He is. Oh. Harris's. That shouldn't be as effective as it is. <laughs> no, but I, I think we know our, our uh, kick-off manoeuvre now. Yeah. Yeah. Great first touch there, Gareth. Well done, mate. That's the reason why you're now 77. Oh, you mean his rating? I thought you meant his age. Oh, right. Feels like it. Like that, then. All good. Yeah. Just about. Oh, okay. I don't want to pass her, just the guy who's right in front of you. I overhead it somewhat for that, yeah. I think. Well, I think I, no, no, I did, but I thought I had to go. Here's a strong. I feel like I should have got a free kick out of that and then didn't. Madness. Got our one at a stream earlier, which I hit the crossbar with. Oh. Oh yeah, I was, when it went that way, I thought, well, he's hitting it, so that's cool. I'm glad that one didn't go in, to be honest. Oh, yeah. yeah it's twice as hit the post, only one of them counts, but yeah. Need to be hitting it off the crossbar, that's the thing. Great work, Gareth. Excellent.
We just turn to look at a ball. I was expecting it all the way over the top, I think. I'm not sure if it was coming all the way over the top or what. Yeah, I maybe should have just stopped and hit it. Yeah. There's a big difference between hitting the ball on the run and not. Yeah. Obviously, my mind was already like, oh, press it because it's coming over and then it all went wrong. may not have realised it was me. Uh-huh. Oh. Well. Found his right foot for you. Yeah. Let's get one up and then we'll really start fucking around. Yeah. I was just like, oh look, I got Valbrana, what should I do? This is always what you should do with Valbrana. <clears throat> mm. I'm thinking maybe a hundred times out of a hundred, it should be stop sprinting and just hit the fucking ball. Because it's too effective. It is. Please play a million more passes like that, Sif. I shall try. I've done it for you enough fucking times. <laughs> no. Goes the other way, mate. Yeah. Get the old radar checked after that one. Fucking hell. Oh, I can't even blame it on the lag, really. I'm just like, oh, I'm gonna hit the ball. That's great. Hit the ball. Ready, hit it. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Reverie is not Valbuena, weirdly. No. Basically how the game divides. If you go right, you pass it. If you go left, you run it. Yeah. Do we? No, I think they do. Oh, somehow. For that completely fair challenge. Oh, okay. You know, ignore the one just before it. Fucking hell. Yeah, I was trying not to run into you, surprisingly, but 
I mean, there's buttons that make yourself yeah, do it. Yeah, I, I, I tap those two buttons. I'm not sure if I'm getting a bit of lag on my end. It feels very clunky at, at the moment on my end. Uh, it's running fine here, so yeah. it's for you. Exactly. Yeah, it doesn't look clunky, but it feels it. It's possible. Yeah. Somebody with the ball. Uh, with the marker select. But no. Nope. It didn't matter, I was always hitting that anyway. Yeah, that's fine, it was just. You know. Ugh. Hmm. Long day. Ah, uh, no, not particularly, just not enough sleep as always. Fair enough. Oh, yeah. That's your standard, really, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so hoop it up, see what happens. Evidently that. Did you watch AEW? Yeah. Sort of a half watched most of the matches to be fair. That red velvet match was fucking weird. I sort of zoned in and out of that. But it was like that was it. That's basically three things that happened that were super weird yeah twice she hit this oh yeah two of them were this move twice she hit this this like suicide dive les uh fez press thing okay and every time she hit it she came crashing to the ground like a fucking sack of shit it was the weirdest looking thing ever oh great it was so strange and then the finish was her missing a standing moonsault like, she literally moonsaulted too far, landed on her face, and that was the pin. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I, I got nothing. I, no yeah. idea. The whole the whole match was super strange. Yeah. Like I said, match-wise, there wasn't much that really made me think, Oh, shit, I need to sit down and watch this. I can't remember what matches there were. Um, opened with Hardy and Cassidy. Hardy got his face smeared all across, his nose smeared all across his face. Yeah, I was trying to find out where it happened, but I just couldn't quite see it. Uh, it was, um, they did a move off the top, I don't remember what, and Orange landed on him. Oh, that's what it was then. Uh, Varsity Varsity Blondes, uh, Lucha Bros. Zoned out, don't yeah. talk about Varsity Blondes. Yeah. I love the Leech of Brace, but fuck. Yeah. I had a feeling it might be in Varsity Bros going over, but that's just because I thought it was the final, and it wasn't, so I was like, oh. Um, that was Malachi Black and Brock Anderson, main event. Wait, time. Yeah, we all know what was happening there. Uh, says Get a lot. that lad out there. Says a lot. Oh, wait, that's Bill Buena. Move someone else into that position, oh. I think. Yeah, let's have a go. Oh, I did it too low. All right. Sorry. Experimenting. Yeah. Experiment. Experimenting. Um, oh, there was a trios match. Kingston, Mox, and... Darby versus oh yeah, JD Drake and uh, QT and company, I think. Yeah, uh, Comoroto and yeah, yeah. Yeah, 
Aaron Solo. Mm. The former Mr. Bailey. Yeah, I couldn't. I thought, yeah. For some reason, I thought Cutie Marshall was in it. Oh, I just can't remember. Maybe there was a Cutie Marshall match, and I'm just. Honestly, can't bloody remember because I don't care enough. No, that's fair. I'm in the same way. I, I, I block out any QT Marshall things that happens. Yeah. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay, so I was. Yeah, I forgot our plan. I was too busy thinking what happened on AEW or what did or didn't. Dark Order fucking. Uh... Evil Uno fucked up and he's ruining the Dark Order. Apparently, yeah, so is that. But that's just because Alex Reynolds has had a kid, right? And so this is how they're going to get him to go away for however many weeks. Oh, I think. oh okay. I think? I don't no, know. I, I, don't, I don't know. That would be my guess. Fair enough. I don't know. Oh, let's talk about another fucking thing. So you know Punk's been doing a thing where he writes uh, initials on his on his shoes? Uh, no, but sure. Okay, so the first show that he had Punk out, he had one shoe with CF, yeah. and one shoe with AC on it. Okay. Which is Charlotte Flair and Adam Cole. Okay. And then last night he had one shoe with BW on it for yeah. Bray Wyatt. Yeah. And I don't fucking want Bray Wyatt. I know you don't. You don't want spooky oh, bollocks. <sighs> Okay, it's not that I don't want spooky bollocks. I don't want in-ring spooky bollocks. I like it. I, it, I'm sure I just I've tried to explain this before, <laughs> but like, if you look at okay, Malachi Black is spooky bollocks. Yeah. But then he gets in the ring. And he's a Muay Thai fighter. Oh yeah. He doesn't do any spooky bollocks in the ring. He might sit down every now and then and cross his yeah. legs, which is an intimidation thing. It's not spooky bollocks. Whereas Bray Wyatt turns into a fucking like the bell rings. He turns to fucking some scorpion ghoul thing that makes pictures of maggots appear. Like, what the fuck is that? Yeah, I get that bit. Undertaker does spooky bollocks, the bell rings, and then he fucking turns into where well, he thinks he's an MMA fighter when he really isn't. Yeah. But what you want is spooky bollocks out if it has to be and then get in the ring and have a wrestling match. Yeah. Like, I don't mind all the Alexa stuff, and then she does things where she's fucking brainwashing uh, people in the middle of uh, matches. It's like, fuck off now. Oh, uh, it's just... Uh, it's your magical doll in the middle of a match. Fuck off. Like, all the mind game stuff outside of match segments, fine. I don't like it, but fine. Don't do it in matches. It was... It was not good. The uh, Eva Marie match. Well, of course it was. It had Eva Marie in it. I know. But... Thing is, the problem with E Marie is right. She's not actually that bad. The problem is, is all other wrestling at the moment is so fucking good. She sticks out like a sore thumb. Yeah. Like you, you can't get away with having shit matches anymore. It's they're they're, they're not a thing anywhere. Like gone are the days we'd have fucking like I don't know Sid versus fucking some other lump. Mm -hmm. And it's like, well, neither of these guys can fucking move, but they don't have to because no one gives a shit, you know. Yeah. It's like, oh look, two big guys doing big guy stuff. Just slowly and, you know, okay. But yeah, like, if you put Eve Marie in a time machine and put her back to eight years, she'd look like fucking Trish Stratus. <laughs> but. Yeah, yeah so that's, not not today. Where, that's not where we're at. No. And I, that's only slightly said in jest. I don't think Trish Stratus is ever that fucking good. I think as a wrestler, Trish Strauss is massively overrated. I think the thing is, she got a lot better in ring. Not oh, saying, for sure. Yeah, absolutely. Exactly. I think that's where it all lies is that she got so much better. Not to say that you know she was great or anything, but the fact is, because it improved so much, it was like, oh my god, look how good she is now. It's like, well, yeah, compared to where she was. Yeah, no, start to finish. Yeah, day, I, I yeah. couldn't argue that in the slightest. But no, my point exactly. is, even at her peak, she wasn't like putting on five star bangers, was no, she? No, no. But I think that's where a lot of the praise comes from, is the improvement. Which, you know, like I said, neither of us are arguing that. And this is, this is where I'm at again, so if yeah. you put even Marina Time Machine, she'd be Trish Stratus. Yeah.
Oh my god, but where the fuck the pass up? Yeah. I dare you get this 50 yard ball wrong. Yeah. <laughs> what a great first touch that was. Amazing. And I don't like that fucking Piper Niven is just now accepting Dewdrop, considering she had a promo two weeks ago or whatever, or saying that she hated the name Dewdrop. Yeah. And she starts off fucking whatever, saying, I like the name Dewdrop. I was like, no, you fucking don't. You just said you didn't. It's grown on me. Fuck off. It's grown on me because it keeps me employed. Yeah, innit? Yeah. Also, I don't want to see her and even rehab a match. I just don't. Like, I have no doubt that if anyone could carry Eva Marie to a good match, it'd be Piper and Evan, but I still don't care. I still don't want to see a fucking good Eva Marie match. Like, what is that? Oh, ref. What? what no foul? Apparently not. Oh, okay. Just absolutely wrap your legs around me. Yeah, I think you got robbed there. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder who uh, whose initials fucking Punk's gonna have on his shoes tomorrow mm. night. <laughs> He's gonna keep doing it, but I don't know who's left. Uh, got... I mean, BS for Braun Strowman, I guess. Oh God. Yeah. I, I can't see that happening. If, if they were gonna have Strowman, they'd have had him by now. You'd have thought. Way. Yeah, you know, <laughs> make sure make sure you go out your way to go get the overhead in. Um, he's already at AC, hasn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Also, I don't think that uh, Punk will be the kind of person to be interested in making a thing about uh, Paul Strowman. No, I didn't think he would be. But you know. I mean, he's hinted at fucking Daniel Bryan in every possible way he can. Oh yeah. Ab apart from the initials on the shoes. I mean, Maybe that's the next one. You need to get a DB or a BD. Yeah. I mean, he pretty much, you know, was like, wasn't exactly subtle yesterday, was he? No. No. Hey! Oh! Oh, if we're hitting them, we're hitting them. You should fucking really hit those there. Yeah. It's the Val Buena effect, I swear. Like, yeah. anyone else since that pass, like, this shot is nowhere near as good, I don't think. Exactly. I mean, who else is there now to really think about? Uh, half of Mexico just left CMLL, like all of Andrade's family or whatever. I get confused with luchadors. Oh, okay. Um, Tessa Blanchard, but I can't see that happening. I can't see Punk being a guy who's going to be like, yes, Tessa. No. No. But also, I can't see AEW ever fucking no. daring signer. Even with Tully there. Yeah. Well, the whole thing is like Tully didn't raise her either, right? I have no idea, to be perfectly honest. That's my understanding. It's a... Uh, was it Magnum TA, maybe? I don't remember. Uh -huh. But someone else raised her. Oh, like, okay. literally raised her instead of... Double. Yeah, oh, okay. That's right. Hold fire on the second half. <sighs> now you're good. That's right. Yeah, who else is left? Uh, I mean, there's the very there's rumblings of Pete Dunne's contract being up, but that doesn't obviously necessarily mean that he's going to be like, oh, I'm going to go to AEW. He doesn't strike me as someone who would go to AEW, honestly. No. We're I mean, good. I'm sure he'd do great stuff with him, but I don't think he would choose to do that. You know? No. He strikes me as very much, I'm where I want to be, you know? Yeah. Maybe I'm wrong. It could be, yeah. What about Bronson Reed? Yeah, possible. 
But that's still, if you, like, he's got, like, another 30 days or whatever, probably, or more than that. I have no mm -hmm. idea. But that's yeah. the whole thing, like, the NXT was a fuck up because of. I, I don't know. What. I don't know. I mean. Either he's free soon or he's not. Yeah, I mean, there's also Bobby Fish. I mean, he would make sense in AEW, but I don't want him there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like I said, I don't like Bobby Fish. I'm just trying to think of people you're on about. Yeah. Yeah. How about someone left field like Chris Hero? Oh yeah. Although it wouldn't surprise me if he's one of the millions of people that fucking punked us and got my. <laughs> yeah, it wouldn't surprise me. Well, to be fair, he's at least coming out looking happy at the moment. Oh, sure, but yeah. punk can get uh, pissed uh, off at some point. I know. else could it be yeah. I mean he could also just start fucking naming Japanese lads he wants to wrestle Kojima <laughs> so that came up as well that's <laughs> Moxley isn't it yeah Kojima Larry yeah <laughs> and of course Punk's there so that's the guy doing the impression it's perfect it's tougher, yeah To be fair, you could just start naming anybody that really good. You know, just put any initials on and just be like, ah, 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 see. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. I don't want Bray Wyatt, and they're going to make him leader of Dark Order or make Dark Order serious, and I don't want it. Yeah. Because the thing, Dark Order were meant to be heels, and they were heels for the longest time, and yeah. then Brody happened. Yeah. And then suddenly you can't be heels anymore, because how can you be in that situation? No, I suppose the thing is, you know, you let it play out, and if they're going to be heel, heels again, then they're going to be heels again. But yeah, I mean, I'm enjoying Dark Order very much more in this role than previous. Uh, I just want it, I want him to come out with BG on his daps. Uh, it's not going to stand for Billy Gun, put it that way. It's stand for Bart Gun. Nope. Um. He's still currently with WWE. Bill Goldberg. Yes. Just to that, take that will never fucking happen. Oh, I know, but just to take the piss. I don't even want it to happen. Also, Punk is the least fucking Goldberg appropriate person of all time. But... I know, but if you want to fuck with the fans. But they don't want to fuck with fans. That's the thing. I know, but I want to. That yeah, but that's why you're you still got your WWE head on. The AEW actually does things that fans want. I know. And it delivers on promises and teases and hints and stuff. Okay, but just turn him heel. Which it's is a... why Bray Wyatt's gonna happen. It's why Charlotte Flair is gonna happen. Yeah. It's why Adam Cole's gonna happen. Because every time they've done something like this, it's been it's it's what's happened. Tony Khan doesn't believe in fucking people over. Is is what I've got from the entirety of AEW so far. Yeah. I mean, I think Charlotte Flair would be, in just in terms of the name, would be a pretty big get. Oh, for sure. Yeah. And you're going to get Rick with that as a fucking guarantee anyway. Yeah. Honestly, I, I would love to see that whole thing. I, loved, I would love to see the Flair family put Andrade with them and actually make that a whole big fucking thing. They still want to have Chavo cut fucking promos for Andrade. That's fine. He can he can put on a suit with Rick. Yeah. <laughs> they'll they'll do just fine. In fact, that's kind of perfect because you can't have Rick doing all the fucking outside ring interference stuff. I all all the time because he's old no. as fuck. Let's be real. Yeah. So you have Chavo do that still. Why not? But then you get all of fucking the rest of Mexico that Andrade is related to that you're trying to get into AEW as well. Yeah. And it becomes a bit big for having the flares in it. 
Alright. Put a bit of curve on it. Yeah, you smacked that like fucking 20 yards behind me. Yeah. I did put a big curve on it, so it's probably not the best idea. And now we know. I made a mess of that. Yeah. So who do you think is going to be the first to really sort of defect to WWE from AEW? Luchasaurus. Yeah. He's been there before, he's huge, it feels like they barely fucking use him. Yeah, that seems fair. Like, you've got to think of it in both ways, it's got to be who would who would WWE take off them also. Mm. It's going to sound weird and it's based on nothing and just a feeling. Adam Page. Yeah. Yeah. The problem is you put Adam Page in a WWE ring and you notice he's only six foot one and it all falls apart. Yeah, but just something that's I got a feeling he's going to be one of the big names that goes. Like I said, I could be incredibly wrong and I probably am, but... Yeah, I just I don't think WWE would be bothered because I, no. I he's not that big. He just looks big in AEW. Yeah, it's a real thing. Yeah. How about no? I'll tell you who would go from AEW. Fucking powerhouse Hobbs. Yeah, they'd be all over him. Yeah. Yeah. Or Wardlow. Yeah, Wardlow's not a bad show either. Stand here in a suit behind the Miz and be angry. Yeah, you know how to, you know how to do that, right? Yeah. Shut up. Stand here. Cross your arms. Yeah. Wear the suit. Yeah. Miz is gonna talk a lot. Then fucking Drew Gulak's gonna come out and try and hit him, and you're gonna murder Drew Gulak. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good word, low. Yeah. I and Fucking the... Jack Swagger would go back in a heartbeat, I think. You reckon? Oh, yeah. Well, let me ask you this. Why is he in AEW? I don't know. Exactly. Doesn't he kind of stick out like a sore thumb the more you think about that entire roster? Um... He does to me. He feels like such a weird, fucking out of place dude. He's like the most mid card fucking mid-level WWE shit ever. I mean, the other thing is, what is he going to do when he goes back? He's going to be Jack Swagger. Yeah. I He's mean... He's going to we the people. And that's about all she wrote, really, isn't it? I yeah. suppose it just depends on the money. I'm saying, but that's good enough for WWE. That's all they're interested in. Yeah. They don't want to do anything entertaining. Yeah, but what's Hagar interested in? Uh... A bigger, a uh, bigger fucking amount of money in his bank account. Yeah, so if they give up to him, then yeah, you go. But do you think they even want him back? I think if he was available, they take him. Yeah. Considering that now they killed NXT, saying we only want big dudes to be main eventers. Uh. Here's a big dude who has been a main eventer I guess. for you. Like they bring back everyone the fuck else. Why wouldn't they bring back fucking Jack Swagger? Is this Jack Swagger? Yeah, but also fucking doing a We the People thing right now could be like massive fucking heel heat. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, this isn't the league. No, it's just some sort of weird cut thing. Oh, 
Oh, we're playing. Oh, this is what I was talking about. This is a South American team. This is Sao Paulo. Yeah. I wasn't paying attention. Okay. No, no, no. We gotta win the game first. Nah. You know the rules. One up and then fuck about. I know. Oh. Yeah, so I'm making a run. I thought, well, okay. Because, yeah, you're making a run. The bunny would go from AWWE. Yeah. And they would take her fucking willingly. Yeah. Hey, you're a blonde with a gigantic racking kind of wrestle. Yeah. You all do. Doesn't matter, we've got like six of you on the roster already. Yeah, we need more. Vince likes what he likes, huh? Yeah. Guess we somehow gave away a free kick. Oh, obviously. That's all we ever bloody do. Oh. To be honest, I'm pretty sure Jericho will go for the right amount of money as well. Yeah. The right amount of money being any amount of money more than you always will be making. <laughs> yeah. Get his Hall of Fame ring and fucking, you know. Yeah. Show up on the wall once every six months so you can fuck about playing shit music with a shit band. Yeah. Brain fired. Like fact to keep it. Oh, I think somebody there is part of the amateur dramatic society. So I don't mind a bit of fuzzy now and then, but it's very, very now and then as a ball. But we'll play Judas, yeah, play Judas, yeah. Uh, I, I mind fuzzy greatly. I'm not surprised by that, to be fair, though. <laughs> that was, yeah, they, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They're high up on the many lists of things I don't fucking like about <laughs> things that approach metal that aren't metal. I was yoink that. Yeah, 
Yeah, Club International Cup. Okay. Okay. I'm good. Yeah, me too. Just have a quick swing. That's right. I, I wasn't really looking to be honest. I just wanted you to yeah. know that I was too. Ran past it like three times in that whole fucking build up. Yeah. that running for nothing. Oh, what a terrible pass. It really was. Oh. I thought it was going in. So I could really do just try and get out of the way and try and get on side. It was like A, get out of the way, and then B, it was like, ooh. Yeah, I figured Shriver's right foot had a chance. Yeah. If we're remembering, just need to have a quick look who was our top goal scorer. Oh, I sure. Yeah. Bit unnecessary there, buddy. Not even a card. No. Unbelievable. terrible pass that is. And that one. And that. Come on, Bob Wayne, get it together. And then he's offside, fuck's uh. sake. I hope this is not like a fucking home and away thing. 
Oh, it is. I believe it is. Pretty sure it was. I may be wrong, but I think it is. doesn't just let him run across his body and smack with the left. So great, you'd like to use your right foot. Bully for you, but um, considering your track record. Right, do better Bale. That was on target, that's an improvement from Bale. Fuck's sake! Just let me fucking have a wonder ball from Bob Wayne who ended up in the back of the net. Yeah. I don't care if we've already had two or three from this stream. I want another one. Exactly. Yeah. Can't do it on the run. Yeah. was uh four yes I also sucked mm. I might be wrong, it might just be the one leg, but... We'll find out, I guess. Yeah. Nope, I think that was it. Okay. Pleasure horn? What the fuck? Pleasure horn. I want to say maybe is there a South African league in it? I may be, but still. Pleasure oh, horn. Well, just like Africa. Either way, we've got to beat Liverpool. No big deal. NBD. <laughs> no. Yeah. I really wish you played in the white kit. Yeah. Really. Starting to I mean, I know there's a kit clash, but I'm starting to think you're not a fan of the orange kit. No? No, I, I, I like it, but I'm starting to think you're not. I don't mind it. Yeah. I just kind of like the blinding white as well. Well, even I can see that, so, you know. That's a good start. I mean, it's come back for a throw in, right? Yeah. Jesus Christ. It's just like the one time it doesn't fucking automatically skip ahead and suddenly taking the quick one. Yeah. I did not mean to pass that, That's but we'll right. we, we got it. I mean, if you're not hard back, you'll be alright. Yep. Yeah. 
but what can you do? Yeah, not get a foul apparently. Quite annoying. Yeah. You think you'd be able to hit a fucking volley and just casually chest a danger yourself once your good foot? Like a bit better than that, but apparently yeah. not. No. For the pass, it was a very nice pass. Sometimes they work. Yeah. Almost said it. I'll do. <laughs> yeah, I was there thinking, oh god, why have we headed it? And then, um, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I thought I'm not going to say anything. I was like, I don't know what. I... So it's very much where I'd be inclined myself to go for the lob. Yeah, it's never yeah. really been my game. No, that's what I thought. I thought, okay, maybe shot cancelling or. I just literally ran straight past him and then. Yeah. There was no cancel there. No, I, I saw there was no cancel. I was like, oh, okay. This is whether I could squeeze it in or not. Hey, I want a free kick. Yeah. It's a Chris Sparrow.
Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I thought that got himself all mixed up. Laggy there. Oh, that's not what I was trying to do. No. That was what I was trying to do, but not that yeah. bad. No. trying to create space was an act for the pass. Yeah. I'm gonna get a red ski, but okay. Yeah, I was gonna get my player to run for a lot more money. He's on target at least. Yeah. Ah, oh, I went the wrong way. Yeah. I need to go out and he went in. Not who I wanted to go to. Oh, what a pass. <laughs> shot cancel. Oh. Uh, I just couldn't get to it. Yeah, shot cancel probably would have been the better Oh, wait, we got a penalty here? I don't know. Surely not. No. no. Wishful thinking. Yeah. There we go. There we go. Nicely done. Three nil, fuck you, Liverpool. Yeah, ain't no Istanbul for you guys. Best in the world. Oh, so here's a question for you: How many uh, bad MMA moves is Punk gonna do when he actually has a match? 
I mean, if you had sense, you'd have him do next to none besides what he already did. Okay, but how many is he gonna do? Too many. <laughs> yes. Yeah. It's like, oh my god, remember the week when two MMA fighters returned to pro wrestling? Yeah. Funny what? No, I remember one MMA fighter and one pro wrestler who had a go once. <laughs> yeah. MMA superstar and punk return to wrestling. Yeah. <laughs> I don't care if I'm like 45 yards out. That's if it's right. there to splash on a volley, I'm fucking hitting. Well, exactly, yeah. I mean, I expected that. I mean, we are expecting right. Bale, Bale to run in the last five minutes. Yeah, I know, but... Yeah. Wow, that was not how I thought that was going to go. No. Well, yeah. Off his fucking knee or whatever. <laughs> well, yeah, I saw you. I was like, oh, well, we might as well. Oh. <laughs> Yay. Well, I think we've taken them as far as we can. Pretty much. But I don't know about you, I don't want to start making the fucking new team right now either. No, I don't want to make the new team now, no. I mean, I suppose the other thing is we play it to the end of the jet. Well, transfer-wise, we do it to the yeah. end of the January window, I guess. Or we could do none of the hard work involved in making a new team and just bump difficulty up and play next season. Uh, no? No, I'd like to move League. All right. Yeah. I mean, we've won the Champions League, the Asian Champions League with them. We've won the league repeatedly with them. There's whatever domestic cup there is. You're not wrong. Yeah. We ain't playing this, that's for sure. No. Well, I'll tell you what, the thing is, we can... Well, there's nothing for us to play. I mean, 
Um, but it's obviously a scheme, but what I'm thinking is we might as well play it to the end of December and call that done. Yeah. Yeah. Get these announcements out of the way, and that is season three done. Day. Oh, okay, got fail. Fair enough. Let me guess. We still did shit this season. <laughs> Bane of your existence. That's not even the release fee, so oh, I fucked up. Well, like I said, I'd say let's not worry about playing the January transfer window. Because sure. If, yeah, because if we're going to copy everybody over, then we can shift off a bit here and there. Do we want to have a look at our youth team only? Um, yes, let's have a look at the youth team. I mean, when we get the new influx of youth team, is what I'm saying. Yeah, we'll play it. Uh, do we get out the 1st of January? Yeah. Yeah, take us to like 1st of January. Yeah, fine places and bloody bloody blah. Uh, stop. Have a look at our manager offers. Just out of interest. Uh... Management career. Oh, nothing that makes me want to go elsewhere. No. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. Well, it's season three. Pretty much done dusted. We'll have a look at our youth team and see if anybody want to bring up and take with us. Uh, that's a lot of positions. Yeah. And we do use all of those. No, don't use all of those. We use a lot of those, apparently. Yeah. And that's Shape Monreal. Mm. <laughs> Lucas Lever. Yeah, there's a lot of names. Not necessarily the names we want, but there's a lot of names. Uh, I'm going to take Tadic. I'm going to overrule anything you might have to say. We're going to take uh, Tadic. Well, he does play a position or two. I mean, that's not why, but yes. <laughs> um, there's this guy. Yeah, James Mon, I heard he's not bad at times. Maybe you've heard of him. Yeah. Ah, uh, you know, why not? And yeah. also, I would like a streamer. Yeah. So anyone here who is jumping at you, are you think, oh, we could maybe do with something in that position? Not or really. are you kind of good? I think we're kind of good. Let's see who's down lower. Anybody who's like suddenly going to be like, oh my god, they're going to turn into a god. I mean, there's Marek Hamsik. Yeah. So <laughs> I mean, we both want him, but we don't want him. But we both want him, or at least I want him. There was a time when I rated him as a goalkeeper. As did I. It wasn't for long, but it was, you know. And then, then his brain melted. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we can take one more signing. I think we should do it just for the sake of completion. Oh yeah. Is and I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Leave my cursor over this guy right here. <laughs> now, if you want to talk me out of it, I'm I'm more than willing to hear you out. But at the moment, but the other thing is, we got so much money, we could just take Navas as well and Monreal if we really want to. I mean, yes, we could, but the problem is then we're going to have to advance because we're using all of our our negotiation things at once. Uh, so, how far do you actually want to go into this? Uh, we've only got pre-season crap to do. I mean, we've 
where it stopped before the first league game. Okay. Yeah, I think that's the fair. All right, we're going to limit ourselves to uh, you team, right? Yeah. Okay. So like you said, we're just taking a big squad over and then we're trimming the fat. And I think that's fair because, you know, we need to get a bit of funds on the go. Sign the dudes. Uh, we negotiate. I mean, I don't think we should send anyone, honestly. No. So you said anybody we even think they're about to sell them is just sell when we restart. So like I said, we'll take a big squad and it means that you know we can trim a lot of fat, get some funds, which I think is fair. And then the ration will use some of these, but yeah. Target man is interesting. Yeah, so we do like that. First time shot. A lot of stuff. Mm, it does have a lot of stuff to be fair, yeah. But how many centre forwards do we really want? Uh, I mean, in, in theory, we're probably going to get rid of Bale next season with the new team. But we've got like three already on our bench. We're bringing up fucking two more. Do we want yeah. to bring up three more? I don't think we need any more, is what I'm getting at. Yeah, I see what you're getting at. I think we take like the two more that allows us to take right now and I think we call it at that. Yeah. The other question is what formation are we gonna play next season? Three six one. Yeah. I think. That's why it was your turn to pick formation anyway, so Yeah, that's why I'm yeah, I think yeah. we're playing three six one. I wanna do something weird, like that's the whole thing. I I Yeah. I, don't get me wrong, playing 3-5-2 and everything being straightforward is fun, but I like to fuck around. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I just try and picture now in my head how I'm actually going to have it all lined up. Exactly. And so I'm thinking what I need. Like, we definitely don't need more fucking set of fours if we're playing one less. I know. By his left footed and has a right foot is interesting. Mm. Unfortunately, that's about all he's got. Yeah. It's very much, I can play attack in midfield. What else can you play? Kind of some others. Yeah, I think for players this low rated, they need to actually be somewhat versatile to actually be of use to us. Yeah. Although, I would like an actual out and out centre midfielder. Because I suspect I will use one at A461. So, I mean, weighted pass is the shit that I want. But yeah, because it works well. You know, this guy has some money and cool things. Yeah. I think that's a lot. Yeah, and then the other thing is we just got to bring them all over. Yep, and that is going to be an off-stream thing that I spend way too long doing, I think. Yeah. I'll tell you one thing, that's not happening tonight. <laughs> uh, no. I might, I might get Dunger and Smackdown or something tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, fair enough. At least got a half a plan. I 
uh, whatever. Hang on, we're uh, just to make sure nothing weird happens. Yeah. And then all of these came in. Okay, so this is our this is what we're bringing forward. Yeah. I mean, it's a big old squad, so like I said, if we want to trim it down, we can. Yeah, but we'll do that actually in game and sell players and make money from them. Exactly. Yeah. All right. And the fucking stream, Seth. Right. Oh, bear with me. Let me find my mouse. There he is. Right. We have, oh, yeah. And also, Spider Goat 44, go follow him. He needs like 0.04, because god damn it. Yeah. All right. Later.